Your friends are out there intimidating Oggs, preying on their fears. I'm not here to make you nervous. I just need you to explain it to me, the central of what's been going on here. I'm not here to make you nervous. I just need you to explain it to me. The essentials of what's been going on here. Essentials. Right. Essentially, I was trying to help my augmented friends. The way I saw it out there, the promise of fake documents was being used to extort people. How does that help them? Ooh, I got you there. The extortion part sucks. I swear to you, I'm totally anti-extortion. Obviously. Let me explain that. As the government, they print up these official permits each month. But they only sell them to the rich corporate and military allies. Meanwhile, the other orgs, they get kettled out of the city because their documents aren't up to date enough. That's what was happening to my friends. Government, corruption versus organized crime. And regular people get caught in the middle. You love the classics. What's this? Whatever your intentions here, you're part of a criminal operation. Hmm. I like to be the nice one. Government corruption versus organized crime. And regular people get caught in the middle. You gotta love the classics. When it was just me, I didn't charge anyone. But then Drahomir shows up and turns it into this big operation with fake checkpoints and ridiculous fees. I didn't want anything to do with that. I wanted to stop. Then why didn't, why you, didn't you? I was scared. Drahomir said he would kill me. Looked at me kind of... Like you're looking at me now. You're not going to kill me, are you? What do you think? I'm not sure yet. Look, the real problem is Drahomir and that checkpoint of his. Without him in the picture, the rest of them couldn't run a lemonade stand. Maybe you could... You know... You think I just walk around shooting people? Don't you? I like knowing there are other options. Okay, so stab him, scare him, or get the police to do their job for once. I remember Drahumir mentioning this cop who threatened him. She was hanging around his checkpoint. Who knows? Maybe there really is one good cop in Prague. That sounds like the safest bet. Otherwise, you're asking me to pick a fight with a bunch of guys in uniforms, scam artists or not. The whole city would come down on you. Still, up to you how you want to handle it. Right. And just so we're clear, you are going to stop forging documents now. I don't like getting into trouble. And even worse is other people suffering because of me. No more faking documents ever again. Unless someone really, really needed one. Then I'd probably do it. I mean, if we knew for a fact that we could help someone, we should do whatever we can, right? Yes. I think it's time to get you away from that forging equipment. It depends on what you have in mind. It depends what you have in mind. The docs I make, they really can fool the authorities. Sort of. Sort of. Sort of. Drachomir flooded the streets with forgeries. So the city started tracking more, adding scanners, validation numbers. Now, unless one of my permits gets activated in the city database, it's just plastic. So you're telling me these people pay for forgeries and then probably get deported anyway? It doesn't have to be that way. I have two permits that I literally just made. And I think we can really help these people. If you're willing. I want to help. Alright, how do we help? Their names are Edward Broad and Irenka Bauer. Drahomir was going to charge them like 20 more times. But maybe you could just give them the forgeries? Early Christmas present? You said it's just plastic that people get deported anyway. How does this help them? I think I know how to get them activated. As long as you're willing to follow through. Alright. I'll go meet Edward and Irenka. In the meantime, are you going to be okay here? Once they learn that Drahomir has been taken care of, the others will leave me alone. He's the one I'm scared of. Don't be scared. I've already taken care of the guys outside. They won't be a problem. Thank you. 
As mysterious military types go, you're pretty neat, I guess. Ooh, wanna go out with me? By the way, there is a safe over there where they keep their money. I'll give you the code. 2489. Feel free to help yourself. Thanks, sexy. Way ahead of you. Oh shit. Oh man, you look really sexy behind that desk. You wanna go out with me? Alright, anyway, let us finish the side quest first. Apparently, the forger isn't that bad as we thought she was. Alright. Ebook. Pause it to read it, guys. Alright. Got some scholar. Newspaper. Alright, let's see. Anything inside the trash can. So after I help you, can I live here with you, girl? Ooh, a double bed for us together. Alright. Where's that money chest at she was talking about? I don't even see it here. What's this on the table? Oh, Fragmine. Wow. She's in a secret hiding place. Alright, let's see what's our objective really quick. Alright. Sign missions. Meet Edward. And... Irinka. Alright, let's do that right now. Alright, let's go back downstairs. No more security for me. Get through this easy. What's here? I can't hack this stuff. Anything valuable here? Let's check it out. Secret passage. Let's enter. Check it out. Not really a secret passage. A secret hideout. More like it. Alright. I think we're pretty much done here. I really can't find that weapon stash she was talking about. So I guess I'll look for it later. Let's get out of here first. Get up here. Alright, how did I get out of here? Let's see. Alright. Let's head on to meet Edward. Hang on. Is there other objective? The golden ticket, meet Edward, deal with Drahomir. Just because Drahomir looks like a cop doesn't mean he's a real cop. He showed me his credentials. They look pretty real to me. Bullshit. The guy's a scam artist. Everyone knows it. If you ever find proof of this, I'm with you. You know that. Not from here, are you? Ooh, a sexy cop. What gives it away? You just walked up to a police officer. And I have this funny feeling you expect something good to come out of it. I used to be a cop, for what it's worth. Let me guess. Not in Prague. And not since the incident. In America. Detroit. A long time ago. I envy you. 
I look forward to the day that I can say I used to be a cop a long time ago. That bad? If I could do it again, I... I would be a fireman. No one looks into a fire and thinks, Shit, does this one really deserve it? You can just follow orders and feel good about it. About the repression in this city. Look, I have nothing against your kind, okay? Personally, I mean... But I am on the front lines of a police state. I am a child of my moment in history. Sounds awfully abstract for a cop. To be competent, I have to be complicit. My way of being okay with that is to be abstract. I don't drag human beings from their homes. I drag historical outliers. I don't shoot into unarmed crowds. I fulfill the will of history. Wow, we sure have something in common. You mean the will of those in power? Same difference. I recently got stopped at a fake checkpoint. Heard there was a cop around here who might know what I'm talking about. Draumir, he's a slippery fuck. Pays off all the right people. Provides all these bullshit documents that prove he's legit. Regional inspector, my ass. I'm putting a file together. A file? This guy's dressing up like a cop and harassing Augs in the street. <sighs> Sounds like 90% of the people I work with. Listen. The right amount of coin in the right kind of pocket, fancy looking paperwork, those things go a long way in this city. Especially if the perception is that he's not really doing anything wrong. Just giving Ogs a hard time. There's more to it than that. That's exactly what I think. Why don't you fill me in? What's Drahomir been up to behind my back? There was a girl named Elena. The way she tells it, she was forced at gunpoint to work for Drahomir. They kept her in a little room and made her forge documents for them. Why didn't she go to the police? She was scared. A lot of people are scared. Yeah, of course they are. Prague's going to hell. The bad cops don't care and the good ones are too busy filling out forms. Fuck it. Drahomir has been pulling this shit for long enough and I'm sick of being told to ignore it. Official police business now. Stay out of that. What do you want, huh? Hey, where's that sexy cop girl? I like your style. Damn hunter. Oh shit. Milena, I've got an update on your friend Drahomir. I've seen Drahomir pretend to be many things. My friend was never one of them. It's been taken care of. He's not gonna be a problem anymore. Oh, Thank poor God. cops. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad you did. Listen, if you ever need documents for something... I'll be fine. Thanks. <laughs> What the fuck was that? You just rushed in and killed everyone. Aw, oh, poor cops. Some of them are dead. Oh, he killed those corrupt cops. Take off your mask. I want to look at your beautiful face. Something is out there. I know it. All right. Let's see what's our next objective. We should have helped out and shoot, I guess. Meet Edward and Irenka. All right, we're done here. I know you don't want to die. Damn, that cop was really sexy. 
Alright, let's go here. The old man was supposed to be alone. Let's go. Here. Heard you're sitting on the cash, Grandpa. Get through. Fuck you. Oh, time to die, motherfucker. Thank you. Thank you so much for what you've done. Sup, Edward? Thank you. I, I didn't know what to do. There are not many people a man like me can call on for help. What did they want? What everybody wants. Money. To feel strong. At first I thought they were here to take me away. Any moment now, they will take me away. Maybe it doesn't have to come to that. Don't get that old man's hopes up. Unless... My daughter? Did she send you? She did, didn't she? Why else would you? Please, tell me. When can I see them? Why would your daughter send me? No, that's not who sent me. You paid someone for an odd permit, do you remember? No, that's not who sent me. You paid someone for an AUG permit. Do you remember? Oh, yes. Those officers who stopped me. Sure, I remember. They charged me three times already. Said it was a very complicated process. I knew it wouldn't get me anywhere. But you kept paying? I was desperate. I would pay a hundred more times if it meant I could stay close to my family. To what is left of them. I want to stay in Prague. Why did you get augmented in the first place? Why did you get augmented in the first place? When my children had children, I wanted to keep up with them, mentally and physically. I wanted to take them to the park, push them on a swing. All of this was before the... You know. Before the incident. Right. Incident. How ironic, hmm? I get augmented so I can be closer to them, and now... And now it's not permitted. Where's your family now? Where's your family now? They're here in Prague. There are places I can go sometimes from where I can catch glimpses of them. And at least I know they're alright. You never speak to them? Maybe someday. I think I still have a chance with my grandson. Children are better at forgiveness than adults. Is it not true? They're better at forgetting. What happens if they catch you without a valid art permit? They'll take me to that complex they built. Golem City. Are you ready for that if it happens? Not one bit. I'm an old man. I'd rather die somewhere that's familiar than live somewhere that's not. Wow. Golem City. Pfft. It's for criminals and revolutionaries. I am neither. You're so innocent. Here, this permit should fool anyone at a glance. Here, this permit should fool anyone at a glance. I remember the officer saying I would have to pay again. Is that true? You know the drill by now, no. No, I'm not here to collect. I'm here to help. No, I'm not here to collect. I'm here to help. I appreciate that. So, what now? Do I have to activate something? I can put on my nice coat if necessary. If I have to wait in line, I'll wait in line. I don't complain. The situation's a little less legal than that. Oh. Do you need me to break in somewhere? I'll take care of it. Just try to keep a low profile until I figure out how to validate your number. All right. I can do that. I will wait here. What's up, Edward? Hey, you have the same name as me. And you, you deserve to burn and die for sticking a gun into someone's face. All right. Let's go to the next guy, but let's sell some of our weapons first. Hang on, where's that hot ass cop? State police business. Just where's that girl? This is abuse of authority? <laughs> Believe me. We will not tolerate Alright. 
I'm kind of lost in the city. Another one. Oh, look at this. You look like one of those singularity. Hang on. I want to go to a vendor first. What a place. Great. Another one. Getting to be as many go. flanks here as in Golan. Sometimes you have to stand up to people. Do the right thing. Wow, you look like the prettiest cop out of everyone. Wrong place, wrong time. I feel sorry for you, Kamei. Another one. Sometimes you have to stand up to people. Ooh. Do the right thing. Hey, we're both clocks. I'm flirting with you. What the hell? It's gone. Pick up his gun. Ooh, corrupt cops. Combat rifle. There you go. All right. Who's this? I wish I had a coat. A nice warm trench coat. Wow. You're so pale. Damn. This game is all about traveling a lot sometimes. It's going here. Where's Irenka? We were machines, sir. But terror and pain have turned us into souls. There is something struggling within. Moments when something enters into us. The oh shit. Come upon us which are not of us. We feel what we did not used to feel. We hear voices. Teach us to have children so that we may love them. Ooh. Primus, is that you? Are you a rank of Bauer? Who are you? Please take whatever you want. Just leave us alone. I didn't come here to take anything. You haven't? Irenka, she gets very scared. Whatever you've come to tell her, you should first tell me. I, I am the robot Helena. Irenka is not well. We must shield her. Irenka paid someone to make her an AUG permit. To keep her from being taken to Gollum City. That someone wants to come through. Really? If, if that's true, she'll be... We'll be very happy. If we can stay in Prague, maybe they'll even... Have kids. There was once a great plan <laughs> that predicted so much. Robots, revolutions, the future of mankind. She memorized all of it. It's her way. It's my way of trying to understand. I'll take your word for it. Here. This permit is good enough to fool anyone who takes a look at it. Does... Does this mean I don't have to hide anymore? It's not that simple. You're still in danger. The permit needs to be activated. Otherwise a routine scan will mark you for Gollum just the same. Uh, I don't understand. Sorry. There's no legal way for you to stay here. You should prepare for the worst. Uh, I, uh, we don't know how to prepare. I'll take care of the activation. Just keep a low profile until I can get it sorted out. Thank you. We appreciate it. Now, do I get a date with you? We're both when augmented. I remember both those odds you made permits for. Now what? There is a computer at the government kiosk that handles the Augment Permit Registry. You'll have to... access it. Quote, unquote. You Hack it. Again. The code to the server room is 6788. Be careful, there may be other forms of security. Alright, I got it. Alright. Let's check this... pocketbook out. Damn, I can't really read this language. Next page. Radius robot, what the fuck? 
Alright, I'm gonna rob the place for a bit, so don't mind me, lady. Pocket secretary. What's this? Dear sister, I no longer know what to do. I have entertained your science fiction fantasy for a month now, but I fear it's only making things worse. You are rehearsing for a role that does not exist, using robot Helena to hide from the world has become. I want to help you, I rank up, but I don't know how. Please tell me what to do. <laughs> oh, look at these audience. Robot. A little tigger. A stuffed bunny. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, let's finish up this quest.